We hustle daily. What's going on, you two? Welcome back to another auction video. It's your boy, Big Clay Ray, coming to y'all with another auction video. That sun is bright out here. We had IAA picking up the GMC Envoy you guys seen in yesterday's video. If you haven't seen yesterday's video, make sure y'all check it out. And I'm gonna keep telling y'all in every single video, make sure you cop your merch. I got my We Hustle, Out Hustle Everybody on, Out Hustle Everybody sweatshirt on. Make sure you cop your merch at wehustledaily.com. If you wanna learn how to check out cars, how I pick cars, the whole nine, how I sell cars so fast, everything. I got a lot of tips and tricks I'm showing y'all in WHD Academy. So make sure you check that out and make sure you follow me on Instagram at we hustle daily.co if you've seen yesterday's video you already know we paid sixteen hundred dollars for the gmc envoy it is the ugly envoy with the ugly back i pretty i like i don't like that back but you know we're gonna see if we can make some money off of it we paid sixteen hundred for it um let me know in the comments below if you think that was too much i know some of y'all probably you know gonna say that that is too much and then some of y'all probably gonna say it was probably a good deal but y'all let me know in the comments below i'm always you know interested in hearing everybody's opinions but be waiting for them to bring it out let's get right into it right here right here check them out hustle nation that's 1600 y'all let me know what y'all think right here check them out check them out check them out yes sir appreciate it all right y'all see it i think we got the flat on the other side this is one big boy right here y'all see it Huge. Let's go ahead and address this flat first. We're gonna go ahead and grab our little thing right here. Y'all check it out. Y'all let me know what y'all think. Big SUV status right here. Sixteen hundred dollars. Sixteen hundred. Y'all let me know what y'all think. Hopefully this pops right up. I'm gonna show y'all the truck in a minute. Let's hope this pop right up real quick. Matter of fact, let me show y'all the truck right now. Then I'm gonna go and get to work. So y'all check me out. If y'all remember from yesterday's video, you know what I mean? So, check me out. What y'all think? This one is the one with the ugly back. I don't know what water is doing right here. What is that about y'all? Not sure. But, looks good to me, Hustle Nation. Let's go ahead and pop the hood, put some air in this tire, y'all. And um, we gonna be all right. Damn, this is a big truck, y'all. For real. So let's see what we got, man. Let's grab our uh, our towel here. Y'all, let me know now what y'all think in the comments. Hold on, let me put this up. All right. Let's check that oil. Definitely look like we got some oil in there. Let's do that one more time. Ooh. What's up, Hustle Nation? This video has been sponsored to you by WHDAcademy.com, the online course that's going to teach you everything you need to know about the auction game, all my tips on how to properly inspect cars, and most importantly, how to make money. As you can see, I've been doing this for a while, and as you can also see, I have plenty of testimonials on how I've helped others gain success in this business. So if you're interested in learning, be sure to click the link in the description below. And we're gonna have to check our cooling too. Make sure we good. So it definitely has oil in here. The motor looks good, fairly good. Y'all let me know. Looks like they got a towel right there. Look like, huh? So let's see what our oil, I mean our cooling looking like. I got a little cooling in there. Oh, okay. This one has a res uh, radiator cap. I didn't see it, so. Y'all know we gotta check here. This is the most important place to check right here. Not right there, right here. And we good to go. So y'all see it? So your boy gotta put some, um... Are you serious? I know this ain't the battery. I know I don't have to take this off to jump the car. I just know I don't to get that battery. Well, not to jump the car, but to even get to the battery. Like, damn, you gonna make me do all that to get to the battery? Like, come on, yo. But we'll be able to do it right here with the positive and the negative right here. So let's go ahead and get to work, Hustle Nation. All right. Got a prank. That band is going crazy just like yesterday. But y'all hear it is shutting down a little bit. Looks 
like that don't have no power. Let's try this one. Nope. Dang, that sucks, huh? Let's try that one. There we go. So hopefully some air can go ahead and uh, fill this tire up. Um, I might actually have some... Uh... Oh. And the, uh, the terminals was on the side. I ain't see that, y'all. But, um... Let's see. I might actually have some fixer flat in here, y'all. Y'all know I keep everything in this bad boy, man. So I'll probably throw a little bit of this in there real quick. Make sure we good. Hopefully it does, uh... I don't know. We're gonna see though. If not, your boy gonna be having to get to work. I got the jack. I got the jack in the back seat of uh, back seat of bubble. So let's go ahead and take this off. Actually, Put this back on. Wrong way. Wrong way. Wrong way. Big play, Ray. All right. this with me just in case you gotta stop and get gas or anything like that i'll throw this in the back seat so we're gonna be good to go oh gotta grab that i got mom dukes with me today so we uh we're not gonna be leaving bubble today and it does look like it's going up so we're gonna put some fixer flat in that thing and uh hopefully there it is right there Alright y'all, we I don't know. What happened to the dam? Alright y'all, let me go ahead and do this. Alright. Bubba had to say the day, y'all. Bubba had to say the day. Bubba got to say the day. We have to use Bubba to put the air in the tire. I didn't want to use all my juice in the jump box just yet. So Getting them right though. Y'all see the big boy truck. Y'all let me know what y'all think in the comments below. We got Bubba still holding it down, y'all. Know y'all be talking about Bubba main, but Bubba doing his thing main. So we're gonna get this pumped up, man, and we're gonna go ahead and hit head straight on the road. Hustle Nation. Shout out to the whole Hustle Nation. I'll see y'all when I get on the road. Alright, finally the moment of truth. Squeaking going on, y'all. What's that? Is this door closed? It wasn't closed. Alright, we on the road, y'all. Let's see. Okay, switched. Okay. So far, so good, y'all. Let me know what y'all think. But y'all see it, man. We riding 1600 buckaroos and we shifted in everything. It has 165,000 miles. Y'all see it, 165 on the miles. Y'all see it, we riding though. This is like the most nerve wracking part all the time when you, uh, gotta take the car on the street especially when you buy it from a place like IAA and Copart do not get to drive the car y'all but I'm pretty happy with it man seems like we're riding good just hit a little gas yeah 165,000 miles y'all let me know what y'all think in the comments below like I say I'm always interested in hearing the hustle nations I'm paying on if i pay too much for the car but y'all can see it there's no overheating dam we need some gas though huh okay so we gotta go to the gas station main then we're gonna get this bad boy cleaned up and y'all know how we gonna do it we're gonna try to see if we can sell it pretty fast y'all let me know in the comments below what y'all would post this car for seeing that i paid 1600 for it uh what would you post it for let me know in the comments below all right, Hustle Nation, and I did make a mistake. When I hooked the jumper cables up, 
Shit, don't nothing work in here. The interior lights, the don't nothing work. And the check engine light came back on. If I hook the scanner up to it, um, the scanner not even lighting up. The windows don't work or nothing. So I'm gonna check up under the hood. It's usually a fuse that uh, causes that. So uh, amateur mistake, man. This is my, my fault. As you can see, it's getting a little darker, but we're gonna go ahead and go to the car wash um, just to get that, uh, just to get this over with, you know what I'm saying? And then tomorrow we'll probably pick back up, but I gotta address this fuse for sure. So let's get to the car wash and um, we're gonna see if we can fix this problem here with none of our interior lights working, like none of them. So we gotta get this fixed, y'all. Amateur mistake on my part. And all right, Hustle Nation, we are not gonna be able to make it to the car wash. It's getting pretty dark out here. So we're about to head to Napa. We're about to get this mega fuse for this um, um, interior lights. And I'm gonna go ahead and put this on tonight because it's bothering me. The check engine light is on, the seat won't go back, the radio not on, the windows won't raise down, the check engine light is on. It's just, none of none of the interior is working. So it's, it's bothering me. The lights won't come on, like no, nothing, nothing works. So we're about to go ahead and get this mega fuse. Like I say, amateur mistake, but we're gonna go ahead and get this mega fuse right here at AutoZone. Hopefully they don't close. I'm not sure what time it is, but I'm at the light, so I should be good. And we're gonna go ahead and put that on and um, we're gonna see if it works. And then tomorrow, we're gonna go ahead and clean this boy up. All right, we in Otto's Snow, we in O'Reilly's. You gotta find a makeup day. Oh, damn, they don't have the right one though. They got a 200, they got 250. I need 125. Don't look like they have 125, Hustle Nation. Man, it's gonna be a hassle to find one fuse. Come on now. And that's where it was right there. Where did I just see it? Yeah, 125. They don't have it, man. So on to the next store, man. Damn. All right, pulling up to Advance, man. Napa didn't have it. Didn't have it. Uh, Riley's don't have it. Come on, Advance. Do your boy right. Let's see. All right, and we're at the AutoZone. I decided to do it right here, guys. So I'm gonna show you guys what um, Mega Fuse I'm talking about right here. As soon as I get it off, in one second. So this is the mega fuse I'm talking about. Okay, that wants to stay on there, so I'm probably gonna leave that on there. And that's the mega fuse. So let's go ahead and take this off here. Um, come on up, come on up. All right, it wants to be a little bread. Let me get it off real quick. All right, and just needed a little screwdriver action right here. So this is the fuse that's blown, so we're about to buy another one of these and put it on and hopefully everything's good to go. This video has been sponsored to you by Auto A Stat. Now, Auto A Stat is a tool that I use to help me find out if cars were staged in Copart. For example, this 2021 Cadillac CT5 was sold for $24,800. But if you go down, you can actually see more information about the car. You can see that it was vandalized. That's why it's here. The car starts and everything. But if you go all the way down to the sales history, you can see that the car was also sold in 2021 and you can find out more information about it it was uh, sold by the insurance company state farm but if you click it you can also see that the car had another lot number that sold for 20,000 if you look at the photos here you can also see that this car actual damage was right here on the side there so that means that someone bought the car fixed the doors and then resold it back in Copart for $24,800 and they actually did the writing themselves so they were the ones who vandalized the car this website can also be used if you want to know how much I bought my cars for because I never really tell you guys how much I pay for cars so you can also find how much I pay for cars and if something is fishy going on with the car so if you are interested my link is in the description below make sure you sign up with my referral link and lastly this website can also be used for Copart and IAA so here's the Copart website all you would have to do is copy the lot number or the VIN number or you can go to IAA and also just copy the lot number. So here's the lot number here and all you would do is set it up top and there you go. So it works for IEA and Copart. And lastly, there is a monthly subscription. I personally use the Pro Package, which is $49.95, but you can also get the personal 
um, package, which is $19.95. You can look up cars in the last two years, and with the Pro package, you can look up cars in the last four years. But when I tell you guys it is worth it, it is really worth it. It has helped me save a lot of money. All right, 125 mega fuse. So I'm about to put this on, and hopefully it solves all our problems. Hustle Nation, man, because it's been a long little day here. So I'm going to go ahead and uh, tighten everything back up. And we are going to see if it works together, man, because it's been a long little day. We didn't get to clean the car or nothing, y'all. So this is all good, though. Let me get this on, and uh, we're going to see if it works. All right, we got everything hooked up. Got our battery hooked up. So wish me luck, man, because... Uh, Yeah, everything's lit up, y'all. Shout out to the whole Hustle Nation. Amateur mistake on my part. It cost me five bucks, man, but let me go ahead and give these folks their tools back, man. But as you can see, everything's lit back up. The radio working again and everything. So that was the problem. The door locks wasn't working. So everything's working now, Hustle Nation. Amateur mistake on my part, but at least it was just a $5 fix. And let me show y'all what I did do. So when I showed y'all earlier, what I ended up doing was putting the jumper cables here for the positive, because y'all can't see it, but it is red. And here is a black one. So I hit the red and the, um, I hooked it up from red and black. And, um, you know, obviously these are probably both power. So, you know what I mean? So instead of hooking it up here first, so that's what happened. So I'm gonna catch y'all tomorrow and we're gonna get this bad boy cleaned up. It's gonna be a wrap for today. So. See y'all tomorrow in a jiffy. All right. Next day here, hustle to the nation. All right. So we're going to have to. Um, I brought a bucket and everything. I brought a bucket. It's the next day. I already got some soap and stuff in there. So. We got a water hose over there, so I'm probably about to try to use that real quick. Oh, let me turn Bubba off, man. All right, Hustle Nation. So here we go right here. Y'all seen it yesterday. We got it right. We got him right. Let's start getting this thing real quick. Damn. There we go. Here we go, Hustle Nation. First crank in the morning. As y'all can see, everything lit up now. Cranks right up. That check engine light is gone. We need to go get emissions on this thing. That change engine oil light. There it go. I'm about to say it does go off, but there it is. So, y'all seen it, man. All our windows working, everything. I still ain't figured out what's going on with this tailgate, though. I know you probably gotta address that, you know. I could try to use the key. I'm gonna go ahead and move it right now and um, get it cleaned up, y'all. Because it does need to get cleaned up. I'm not gonna be able to clean it up here. I was gonna take it through the uh, $7 car wash again, but hey, we pay rent over here at the office, so boy about to uh use the water right here shoot they got a water hose so let me move this out the way let me put bubble right here so no one takes my spot and um we're gonna be good to go all right it's gonna do it right here hustle nation
right, let's check them out now. We still got to do the inside, but let's see how we looking right now. Y'all let me know. That might be the SRT one, huh? And they got a lot of little nice cars going on over here. That's, oh, what they got going on over here? But y'all check it out. We got the Volkswagen. But yeah, y'all let me know what y'all think. Did I clean them up good or what? You know, it ain't perfect, you know? I know some of y'all be like, oh, my detailing skills are not that good. Hey man, listen, it's all good. It's a used car. You know what I'm saying? Y'all think that's gonna boost the price up? I don't think so. This truck look good enough to me. Check it out. The boy clean. Boy look good on that camera. Shout out to the whole Hustle Nation. Make sure y'all cop y'all merch now. I'm gonna keep telling y'all. So we gotta um get this interior clean. That uh I cannot get this gate open for some reason. I'm not sure what's going on. I didn't push the button, that little yellow button back there, and y'all hear it. I'm probably gonna have to take the battery off and um so that damn thing will be quiet. Cause it's getting on my nerves. You see that little red yellow button back there? I had hit the yellow button and um yeah, I was trying to get it open and the thing ain't shut up since. So we got to go ahead and vacuum them, vacuum them up. And it says see manual tailgate. So if y'all know something about that, let me know in the comments below. But I'm going to just uh, take the battery out for right now so that thing will stop making noise. And for all you guys who asking, am I a dealer or stuff like that? Yes, I am an auto broker. I have an office space instead of the lot. So I am an auto broker. You know what I mean? So. But y'all let me know. Let's go ahead and get this uh, thing vacuumed up, y'all. All right. And before we go get them uh, vacuumed up, I noticed that my OBD2 scanner, make sure you get this in a link in the description below, Hustle Nation. I noticed that it's um, it's not getting power, as you can see. It's hooked up, but it should light up. So um, number 13, which is, set that right there. So number 13, which is, where is number 13? The cigar. So cigar, and it's going to be the 20 right here. I already took it out. And let me see if I can show y'all on camera that it is blown. Y'all see it? Yeah, y'all see it. That boy is blown, y'all. So y'all already know we keep everything in the back of Bubba Main. So, you know what I'm saying? They go right there, right in my face. Hustle Nation. So, I know. Let me see. Hopefully, we got a 20 in here. If we, there we go. Is that a 20? Yeah. All right. Ooh. Damn, see? I shouldn't be doing that, y'all. I'm tripping, man. But as you can see, we lit back up, man. I should have took the battery off and did that. I know, I know, I know. I should have. My bad, y'all. I'm messing up. I'm trying to get it the, the, the main fuse to pop on me again, huh? I know, right? This ain't learning my lesson, huh? Let's see. Psst. So, I think it might have something to do with that fuse, man. So, we're going to go ahead and put everything back together. Um, and, uh, yeah, I'm going to put all this back in. We're going to get on the road and see if, you know, clean this bad boy up, man. Pulling right here to the admission spot, too. Just in time for your boy. But you know these cars be doing some weird stuff when the um when all the electrical components and all that's messed up, you know. So if that fuse solved all our problems, we got the SRT8 right there and everything. Y'all see it, you know? We got the SRT8 getting emissions, man. So yeah, y'all see it, man. We about to get emissions on this thing, and we're going to be good to go, you know. I know some of y'all might be saying something about my uh my detail job but hey this thing ride good though i tell you that much though all right shout out to the whole hustle nation man we just passed the missions we good to go hustle nation we good hey them lights them lights shining ain't it don't lie y'all know them lights shining for real them lights are shining y'all y'all see that emissions paper in the uh seat i don't know what that mean the uh window i don't know what that is but it's gonna be all good just a little muffler noise hustle nation it's not that serious but we did get them cleaned up 
We do got emissions and everything, so we good to go, y'all see it. Did I clean him up pretty good or what? Y'all let me know. I think we straight, so. Just like that, it's gonna be a wrap for today's video, Hustle Nation. If you haven't already, make sure you copy your merch at wehustledaily.com. And if you are not part of the Hustle Nation, make sure you join the Hustle Nation. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe, hit that notification bell for your boy. You wanna learn how to check out cars, learn all my tips, all my tricks, the whole nine. Make sure you go to whdacademy.com. Make sure y'all follow me on Instagram at wehustledaily.co. It's your boy, Ray. Big play, Ray. I'm gone. Subscribe. Yes, sir. We're getting it in. in you the are, pandemic. You already know, man. We don't give a damn about no depression, recession. We're going to make it happen. You already know, man.